Well, welcome to Mirna Palooza. This is the uh, staff here at K99, where about six weeks ago, we started our promotion with Ehrlich Nissan, where we're giving away this beautiful $40,000 Nissan Titan 4x4 group cam. And we thought, why not grow beards to celebrate? Like when hockey players start the playoffs, they grow their playoff beards. Well, we thought, why don't we as a staff grow our truck beards? And this is what we've gotten to so far. Now, a lot of us are summer beard growers, you know, where there's some here and some are here. You don't get the full beard, but after six weeks of trying, this is what we've come up with so far. Dave? Thank you, I love it. I love it, it's just great. No, I hate it. <laughs> no shaving, there's been no trimming, it's growing into my mouth, it's, 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 it's not it's not fun. It's not as fun as I thought it would be, I'm going to be honest with you. This is, as I just referred to, the summer beer. <laughs> That's what Dave's got going right here. Kind of a Chia Dave is what I've alluded to it as. Thank you. Then over here, Mountain Man Todd, who is starting to get very furry in the face here, and just a little bit like an Amish starter kid. I like this because you can go very interesting. And then you can go like this because I don't ever grow this stuff in my neck, so I can go, hey. Did I make it? <laughs> but I, I honestly can't wait to shave. I am ready. <laughs> Sean Patrick, what have you done to yours over and over? Yeah, I've probably gotten the most um, made fun of for my beard because I have a blonde, and it's kind of like Dave's as well, where it just kind of grows everywhere. And so anyways, because it was blonde, I decided to dye it, and I've dyed it three times. The last time I dyed it, I left the dye in too long because I wanted it real black, and it dyed my face too, so I was going around looking like uh, my daughter colored on my face, so it's been fun. I've enjoyed it. I actually asked the guys if they joined me for another month, but I guess I'll be alone. Yes, yeah. yes you will. And the veteran, Mr. Beard, this is the Beard Master. Now, we've referred to him as the Hog Father before because if you ride a motorcycle, this is the Hog Father. But that pose, is that not skinny Santa or what? Charlie Barnes, how do you get your beard to grow? No words are necessary. <laughs> Just watch and learn, children. Watch and learn. <laughs> Brian had some anxiety over his beard. I did. I need to get this off my chest. Now, Charlie makes this look easy, growing a beard. Me, I have struggled. For six weeks, I have done this and gotten to this. The other night, and I swear to you this is true, I had an honest-to-God anxiety attack over my beard. I started to feel like it was taking over my face. I'm claustrophobic, and this kept crawling up on me. And I felt like I was losing my space, and I was losing everything and losing my mind and I would start scratching I go I gotta go shave and then I realized I can't shave we're giving the truck away Saturday and we said we were gonna grow these beards till then I swear to God my heart started fluttering I was walking around telling my wife I may need to go to the hospital she said what's wrong I said my beard is attacking me and it's giving me a heart attack and I'm not kidding I was tripping out big time breaking into the sweats I wanted to shave so bad I was like Pedro on Napoleon Dynamite where he just had to shave his head because it was hot well I was feeling that way but you know what I've done? I have grown appreciation for people who had beards. I used to look around, you'd see ZZ Top, have no idea what athletes those guys are. These beard athletes, you think, oh, they're lazy, they don't shave. You have no idea what kind of work goes into this mentally and physically. Saturday, I'm going to shave this off if I can make it till then and hopefully have no more anxiety attacks. I had no idea. I have new respect for the bearded. On Helga, you are a greater woman than I ever imagined. Well done. Well well done. So we need all of the bearded to gather together on Saturday at Boardwalk Park in Windsor. We're going to be giving away the truck that day. Now you still have time. If you win a key, don't shave until it comes time to try the truck. So we need all the furry creatures to gather at Boardwalk Park on Saturday. All the bearded gather together. And it doesn't just have to be guys, right, Sean? That's right. Now women are invited as well. You might not be able to grow hair on your face, but Caitlin, who works in our office, has joined the party, and she's done... Um, truck pits is what she's calling them. Now she doesn't grow a full beard, she's got a little bit of a mustache, no beard, but she's also got the pits now too. So ladies, please join us. Don't shave the pits if you want to keep. We'll see you Saturday. I was just going to say, no one should shave. You can still have five keys to give away. So nobody shave until Saturday and we'll be giving away that truck because it's going to be a nice beard picture with everybody. It's going to be fun. Hair faces unite! Woo! Hair faces! Truck beard! Ha 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 ha!